you. Oh my god, guys. I'm scared now. Mountain lions. Hey guys, Chris here and welcome back to Vex Vlogs. Today, we're delivering in my favorite place. The zoo! <laughs> my town actually has a zoo and I got some deliveries for them. Now it's raining a little bit so I'm pretty sure I'm probably going to be the only one there. There are a few cars in the parking lot as you can see. But I think it's just going to be me. So let's just do deliveries first and see what's up. Oh and check out what I'm delivering today. Frozen food. And as you might have guessed, not the ordinary frozen food. Frozen rats and mice and I don't even know. I don't even want to know. So right now I'm going to the front of the zoo. Usually I deliver to the side and some places might have a problem with you going to the front instead of the side, but this place is not one of those places. Uh, this day I had like 170 stops so I didn't have much time to waste. But I come here probably like once or twice a month and I just wanted to show you one of my favorite places to deliver. Delivery drivers pretty much go everywhere. Hospitals, schools like high school and university, small and big companies, cemeteries, malls, you name it, we've been there. And there are a lot of perks to visiting all these places. Like here in the zoo, I may or may not have gotten free admission to going to a park and looking at all the animals. I like to think that some of the drivers that deliver to amusement parks get to hang out inside and ride the roller coasters. Or if you deliver to a place like Google, you can sneak into their cafeteria and eat all the food. I know this is probably not the case, but one can imagine. In some places, if you're cool with the business, they'll give you free stuff or discounts. For example, there's this place that um, sells wheels. And I joked to a guy, I'm like, hey, yo, you should give me a FedEx discount. And the guy that works the warehouse, he was like, let me ask my boss. And the next day he gave me like a discount for, I think it was like four wheels for like 900 bucks which was pretty good because usually they would cost around 1200 there's one place where they make Turkish towels and every now and then they give me some towels and let me say something those towels are so soft there's also this place that sells chocolate it was like a chocolate store and when I went in there it was my first time in there and looked really cool so I that's why I said I was like yo can I look around because this place is actually really <laughs> interesting and she's like yeah feel free to take something and I was like what really <laughs> It's like, that made my day. Anyways, be cool with the places you deliver to and maybe they'll be cool back. This one here, hello? FedEx, I just have this one package. Oh, hey, just got this one for you. I got like rat meat. You guys want in the rat? back. Um, no, the food, whatever. How many you got? Uh, I got four of them. Four? Uh, do you really want to walk them over and just leave them outside the door over there? Yeah, by the, like the freezer area? Yeah, I think there's some people, um, it might be a truck in front of there, no, maybe not. Yeah, just put it by the door, they'll catch it, I'll tell them it's there. Alright, awesome. Okay. No problem. Oh, the gift shop. You just want me? Uh, you can leave them here for now. You got it. And that one. Thank you. Have a good day. Ooh. On there. This is side entrance. I'm on the left side of the zoo. And usually I would park here somewhere and do deliveries. Yeah, there are a lot of parts of the zoo, as you can see. But um, not everything's open because I, I, I guess it's seasonal. You know, it gets too cold here in New Jersey and you can't keep all the animals here. All these cool displays, underground cities, but I don't know if the animals are out. They should be out, but maybe they're hiding. Yeah. Yep. No, I didn't see any prairie dogs. This is cool. They got the ferrets, buffaloes, the bald eagle. There it is. That's a big bird. Oh, there's two of them. Wow. That's a rooster. Whoa. 
And we got goats. Sleeping. We got the belted Galloway. That guy is huge. Buddy! We got that hurricane thing. You go inside and blow some air around you. I think it's like a hurricane simulator, but this one's a Jurassic Park one. Hey guys, when I say I'm literally like the only one in this park besides the employees, I'm literally the only one. <laughs> so I guess I can give you a private tour of everything here. Condor. It's so cool. Yeah, usually this place is packed with people. Oh my god, guys. I'm scared now. Mountain lions. That's cool. There's a lot of cool stuff here. Holy snap. It's so nice and peaceful. I gotta take Ocelot. I don't see it, but it's probably in there somewhere. Check out these birds. A lot of birds here. These are probably the biggest ones. Hey, buddy. Over here. So these are wherever this is. I'm not gonna try to say that, but yeah. Just chilling. Hey, bye. This guy's really close to me. <gasps> he spotted me. Oh my god, the vulture. Maybe he saw the vulture. He just jumped up. Oh, there's two of them. Whoa. Mistaken. This is not vulture, it's a condor. And their wingspan is 10 feet. And social distancing is 6 feet. Black handed spider monkeys. Oh, he saw me. I love you. Where are all your friends? His friends are probably somewhere up there. There's usually like 10 of them, but I don't see them. Snowy owl. I think they're sleeping because you know they're nocturnal. I learned that in science class. <gasps> I think they're not sleeping. That one just flew. Oh, he's staring at me now. He's watching me. Look at that. I guess they're not nocturnal. Science class failed me. They scared me. Check out that guy. Oh, he wants to hide. And yeah, there are the train tracks that loops around the, the whole zoo. You can get a ride for it for like, I don't know, like five bucks. And it's pretty cool, but obviously it's not operating today. This horses. Here's the barn. I guess we go inside, right? Hello? Chickens. Look, he's just checking me out. It's a donkey. Alright guys, and that was my favorite place to deliver. <laughs> um, so, let me know in the comments where your favorite place to deliver is. Or better yet, send it to me on Instagram or my email of a video of your favorite place to deliver so I can show it off in my next video. I'll give you guys like maybe like a week or two weeks. If you want to be featured on my next video, share your favorite place to deliver. And mine is the zoo. I know all routes in the world don't have the luxury to going to zoos or malls or all the cool places, just houses, boring. Make sure you guys hit the like button and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. All right, peace out.